Assalamu alaikum and welcome back to Future Sales Live on Diet TV. Just to remind you, our topic is Imam Taki alayhi salam. And, um, and just before the break, Miss was explaining a little bit about, um, about a thing that happened. So, um, what happened was, um, um, and then afterwards, um, um, this is um, a a after every bribe, and all, you remember, um, yeah. after all that happened. So, um, um, uh, the, uh, when the Imam was going to get married, um, the uh, Harun uh, Mahmoud Rashid actually said, you can, you can marry my daughter. You know the king that killed, um, um, you remember that king? Yeah, the king, yeah. Um, that, that king said that you can marry my daughter. But then, all of, because um, um, Harun um, um, Mahmoud Rashid, um, he, um, he, um, he, was, he, he was not a good guy, but he was clever, wasn't he? So, so he, he he could he could he could think of us. Um, he, yeah, he, he could think he he could think um, of how he can support himself in the future. So um, what happened that um, he um, he he wants to get his daughter married to Imam um, Taki al Islam. Imam Taki al Islam. The family the family was um, of um, uh, uh, Mahmoud Rashid was actually uh, wait let, let me finish here and and then you can speak. So um, Mamu the family of Mahmoud Rashid was saying why do you want why do you want your daughter to get married to um, Imam Taki alayhi salam? And then to um, um, to prove Imam Taki alayhi salam is like kind of um, like to prove himself Imam Taki alayhi salam to prove himself. There was like a huge meeting, and the bishop said there was like nine hundred scholars there, yeah. And then there was um, um, the Yahya, um, uh, a man Ibn named Yahya, uh, Ibn Aqsam, who was actually a uh, um, 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 a, like a, a clever person at the time, kind of scholar-like person, and he was actually came to question Imam Taqi al to ke to question his knowledge, and then then um, Imam Taqi al would question him and and stuff like that. So, um, Zaki, what, what do you want to say? Was the daughter good or as bad as um, her father? Um, if um, do do you think that Imam would um? Um, marry a bad person? No. No. So, so, so she she was probably good, yeah. So um, um so um um so, so then a whole meeting was gathered up. Nine hundred uh, nine hundred scholars with Yahya um, Ibn Aqsam um, he was there and um, now um, he says um, that um, what would be the kafara? Do, do you know what that means? It means punishment. So what would be the punishment of a person that is in ahram who killed, who hunted and killed their prey? So um, someone, you know what ihram is? No. The thing that you wear to go to? Hajj. Yeah, hajj. Um, the, um, the two cloths that you wear to go to hajj. Black so and white. The white one. The white. Um, the white um, um, the two cloths that you wear um, to go to Hajj and then um, he says so what would be the punishment you know when you're not supposed to, you're not supposed to kill any animal or something like that um, when when you're um, doing Hajj or in Ihram something like that so um, he said what would be the punishment of a person who is in Ihram and actually hunted and killed their prey so um, so then Imam Taki Islam said um, but I would need to know more detail to answer that question. So he he starts saying, talking more more stuff. He say he's saying um. So um, what were some of the questions that he said, Miss Ban? Uh, was the um. Um, Hussein, do you know what? Was he a free man or was he like a slave or and like um was he forced to do it or? Like, did he do it purposely? What well, was did he? Um, I think um, he said, "What well, uh, was um, Miss Wade, you know?" Uh, did, uh, did does he know the Sharia? On yeah, does he know the Sharia uh, on, on um, hunting? On hunting, um, um, uh, um, is he old? Is he young or is he old? Is he adult? Um, um, is he um, what are you saying? Um, has he done it before, or is this the first time? Yeah, and um, and he, he mentioned so many questions of um, of of how you can base this on. Um, you, you get what I mean? Mm -hmm. Yeah, 
and then um, and then we're gonna um, mostly gonna tell us a little bit more about that. So can we start most enough with the loud salawat? Allahumma salli ala Muhammad wa ala Muhammad. Ya ya was shocked and did not know what to say. Mamun al Rashid asked Imam Taki to answer Yahya's question for all of above considerations which Imam Taki did. It was when it was then when Imam Taki to ask Yahya a question which he did and Yahya could not answer so Imam Taki gave uh, him the answer. Mamun al Rashid's uh, joy knew no bounds what what he had asserted came to addressing the audience he said i i did i not tell you that the people of ahlul bayt of the prophet had been gifted by allah with limitless knowledge no one can cope with even the children of the if this if evaluated house yeah, Mamun al Rashi took the opportunity to offer his daughter Umm al Fazal to Imam Taki. Imam Taki read his own nikah, the Qutubba, which of is used today, with myth of five dirhams. Mm-hmm. Imam Taki wrote a letter to him to Mamun al Rashid that he would also give Umm al Fazal Mahra uh, from the wealth of the, from the wealth of the world to come. This was in the form of ten duas <coughs> which were fulfilling a near hajat. This thus this his title Al Jawad the Generous One T- uh, to to answer a fifth question is not e- easy as you may think. This is why all uh, ulama al- spent years of their lives learning and researching and why we have it to duck lid of a madra just like we take an advice of doctors when we are ill, we should take the advice of a major in religious affairs. Thank you, Mosin. So, their Mosin um, is saying, um, and then, then Yaya. Um, uh, the man that asked him the question after he um, went into all of those um, sections of how, how how he can define um, Ali. Um, how, um, when um, I guess you forgot again. Um, no, I, I remember about you. Right, um, well, you. We can come back to you. Yeah, yeah. Um, so um, so then um, y- y- um, after Imam um, Taki was um, talking about all these different sections and how you can put this punishment into it, um, Yahya was actually shocked and didn't know what to say. And then Mamun Rashid said, um, told um, um, Imam Taki Islam, okay, so tell us um, each and um, everyone and how they should be dealt with. So and then. Through all of his, um, all of his, um, um, all all of his sections that he made, yeah, and he he actually um, a- answered all of them, and and he gave so many different branches uh, of how the punishment should end up of being, and and then people was. Uh, uh, like astonished by he's a young he's a young man and he knows this kind of knowledge and then um, and then um, Mamun Rashid he's like proud and he's really happy and then he stands up saying Did, didn't I tell you all all of you that um, that um, the Ahlul Bayt have a gift from Allah Subhanahu Wa Taala that they have knowledge yeah so so he proudly proudly uh, talks out and and saying oh didn't I tell all of you. And he, he said that. So um, um and and so then after uh, after uh, what happened um <coughs> and then um he got married to um um what was her name Umar? Umar Fazl. 
Oh, um al Fazl, and he got and he read his own nikah, and then um and then he um and then he gave like a speech. He, he spoke, and 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 then and then Mosin went on saying, um, this is why, um, um, uh, this is like um, um, um uh, what what do you say? Um, um lemma. Yeah, or uh, this is so he, then he went on speaking about ulimas and how they spend years and years of um, of um, like um, research and knowledge to come up to their level um, to, um, to try to get as near to um, to the uh, imams as they can, um, don't they? Um, the ulimas and um, um, they try to get as near as they can to the imams alayhislam and then. Um, and then it takes them so many years, don't they? It takes them so many years to um, to gain that so much knowledge, doesn't it? Yeah. Uh, and most, uh, for most, for uh, all of the ulimas, they had to spend their life from birth all the way to where they are now, um, or all the way to where they are now, um, um, to research and doing knowledge. So they never had a break and. And it's, uh, and it's been um, um, like a knowledge for life for them um, and, and then he went on saying how we should give to, um, uh, to, um, um, like uh, allegiance and kind of like saying oh I'll follow this ulema um, and um, pe people have different ulemas now um, um, and, and so um, the imam was born with this knowledge already and then people like us we have to from birth and even to death we haven't got the same knowledge as them, do, do they? Yeah. Oh. Um, so thank you for that, Mosin. We said you've got the next thing. So can we start with it off with the loud salawat? Allahumma salli ala Muhammad wa 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 had an uncle called Ali ibn Jafar, who was a very knowledgeable, pious old man. Whenever he went to the mosque, people would surround him and ask him questions. One day, Imam Salaam <coughs> arrived at the mosque when his uncle, who was sitting in the middle of the middle of a large group of people, saw him. He immediately got up and kissed the hand of, <coughs> of Imam Salaam. Imam Salaam asked his uncle to sit down, to which his uncle replied that he could not sit while Imam talked. Taki Alaysam was standing. When Ali ibn Jafar returned among his friends, uh, after after Imam Taki uh, Alaysam had left, his friends told him that it was wrong for him to show much respect to that child, Imam Taki Alaysam, as he was an old man and that and the uncle of the child. Ali ibn Jafar replied that he was showing respect to the child because of who he was. He continued the, that. He continued that Imamat is an office and and a station from Allah, and Allah but and Allah did did not deem him an old man fit and capable for the lead, leadership of the Umayyah, but considered the child capable for Umar. it. Therefore, they should all obey him. His Imam took here some commands. Mawal, the age of a person is not important, but what kind of person they are. Only Allah knows everything about everyone, and therefore only Allah is able, allowed to judge people and say what they do and do, and do not deserve. So what? Allahumma salli ala Muhammad wa ala Muhammad wa ala Thank you say. So there we say he was talking about um, and, and, and at the end he spoke about the moral. So the moral of it um, <laughs> was um, uh, Ali do you know? It doesn't matter if you're old or young. Yeah. It only matters um, who you are and Allah knows everything about everyone. Yeah, so the moral was, uh, because in, in, that, in that part he was talking about, he was talking about um, um, the young Imam um, Taqi Salam and, and this um, old man. And, um, and then he was giving re um, respect, um, he, was, he was getting, um, um, he, um, he, was, he was also giving that respect, but he uh, perceived a much bigger one because of who he was. So it doesn't matter um, if you're an old person. So um, some people think um, old people are more wiser, they're more. Um, um, but we all, w what should we do? 
well, we should uh, be kind to old people and we should give them more respect as well, don't you think? But um, also, it doesn't matter, so you just got to think, it doesn't matter what age you are, um, even though you have to give respect to your elders, it doesn't matter what age you are, old or young, it matters about who you are, oh, yeah, who you are. And um, and how you and look in the eyes of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala because what does Allah say in the Quran? It doesn't matter what colour skin or what age you are, it matters about your your good personality. deeds. Personality? Yeah, your yeah, personality, your good deeds and, and that's um, how Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala sees you. So um and so thank you for that. So uh, um so next week um we'll be talking about Imam Ali alayhi salam and um sadly um Ali and Zaki won't be here this week, um next week would they? Yeah, and and um, uh, Ali and Zaki will be talking a little bit about Imam Ali alayhi salam today. So can we start them off with a loud salawat? Allahumma salli Muhammad wa ala Muhammad wa ajil me and my family will be going on Zirawat to Iraq at the end of the week, and we will be blessed to be taking part in the celebrations for our first Imam, Imam Ali's Laudat. We will pray that our Shia family be blessed to do Zirawat. It was Friday the 13th of Rajab, Friday the 13th of Rajab, 30, Omar Field, Hazrat Fatima Binta Asad, the wife of Hazrat Abu Talib, entered the precinct of the Kaaba and pray to Allah saying oh my protector ease my pain all of a sudden the wall of the Kaaba opened up and see as if by some unseen force went inside the Kaaba and the wall closed. Ali al Islam, the youngest son of Abu Talib was born inside the Holy Kaaba she stayed inside for three days on the third day she came out through the door and Muhammad was waiting outside. <coughs> she told Muhammad that the boy had not taken any milk. Muhammad gave him the first feed from his mouth and afterwards asked his uncle Abu Talib that he wished to adopt the baby. <coughs> Ali entered the house of Muhammad from the very first day of his birth. Ali's mother Fatima Pinte Asad also lived there who looked after his own son as well as Muhammad Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam. So much so, so that later the Holy Prophet used to say that she was like his own mother. As well as our first Imam approaching that it was also short. Shazada Ali Oscars were lauded on Friday, just gone, which was on the 9th. Rajab Hazrat Ali Oscar was the youngest child of Imam Hussein. He was born only a few weeks before Imam left Medina. His, mother, his mother's name was Rubab, daughter of Umrul Zah, who was the chief of the tribe of. In the Ubab had two children, Sakina and Alyaska. Today is 10th Rajab and it is the Wiladat of our ninth Imam, Imam Taki alayhi salam, born in Medina, 10th Rajab, 195 Hijri, Hijra, 12.4.811 AD, died in Baghdad. Iraq 29th G card 2020 his 27.11.8 20, 20, 20, age 25 years period of leadership 17 years at the time of the death of Imam Ali al Rida al Islam our ninth Imam was only nine years old some people doubt Imam, Imam's il eligibility to become Imam at this young age. Colony, 
Kol Aini in his Kafi relates that, that the Mutawakili Mutawal, Mutawalli of the Holy Kaaba questioned Imam for se several days before he was certified and accepted him as the Imam of the time. Allahumma salli ala Muhammad wa ala Muhammad wa Ali, 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 Ali. The brother, the son, in law of Nabi. The brother, the son, in law of Nabi. The star Muhammad loved deeply. The star Muhammad loved deeply. He fought in battles so bravely. He fought in battle so bravely. He is in Islam a great beauty. He is in Islam a great beauty. Ali, 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 Ali. He was born in the house of God. He was born in the house of God. He was born with a heart in float. He was born with a heart in float. He lived with the prophets and he trod the glow in his face. People saw and awed. Ali, 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 Ali. He lifted the Kaaba with such might. Who lifted the Kaaba with such might? He was the apple of the prophet's eyes. Who face resembled the moonlight? The brave soldier who no one could fight. Ali, 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 Ali. Allah had gifted him his great name. From him heaven Zulfiqar came. The Lion of Allah he then became. Defeated by his armies, ran in shame. Ali, 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 Ali. Ali, 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 Ali. On our hearts is your love engraved. On our lips is your God gifted name. We are just your slaves, just your slaves. For your love is what we always crave. Ali, 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 Ali. Salawat Allah. Thank you five for joining me on today's show and I hope you have a good time doing your Zara um, the other and um, hope you learn a lot in today's show and hope you yeah um, uh, yeah thank you and I hope you lot at home as well learned a lot in today's show so we'll see you next week same time same place talking about Imam Ali alayhi salam so we'll see you next week same time same place on Hadai TV but until then good office